They have their own cladding crisis in Bridge End. More than 100 people say their homes have been ruined. Right to touch it, you're going right through. Julie, what's it like living like this? Terrible. Sorry if I get upset, but it's depressing. You try them living in a pauper's house. Yeah. It's absolutely disgusting. I don't leave anybody to come up here. My, my kids won't come up here. Well, you can see the uh, where this protruding here. People in Cairo say a council-backed scheme to insulate and clad was shoddy, and that's putting it mildly. I am 78 now, and I've always voted Labour. I've changed my mind because of what they've done in, into the valley. They've completely ignored the people of the valleys. we non-existent as far as they're concerned. In a statement, Bridge End County Borough Council said most of the problem properties were part of a central government scheme, not the council one. It continued, Bridge End County Borough Council is firmly focused upon putting the situation right and has made a three and a half million pounds commitment to ensure they will be able to benefit. Once upon a time, Labour had a red wall in Scotland. In 2019, Boris Johnson took a sledgehammer to the red wall in the north of England. But here in South Wales, Labour still has a red wall. Yes, it's slightly smaller since the 2019 general election, but a red wall nonetheless. Bridge End's council is Labour, but the MP is a Tory for the first time in years. So how's this local election looking? They broke the rules party gate. Do you think Bridge End will stay Labour because it's Labour at the moment? Yeah, probably, yeah. After yeah. everything has happened now. Oh, I will vote, I think. But it certainly won't be Conservative. Play Cymru. I always do it because you can't trust the others. I will stick with the way you usually vote for. May I ask who that is? No. Businessman Philip McArdle supplies the catering trade and he's sticking with Labour. Well, I wasn't surprised when uh, Bridge End voted a Conservative in. Uh, but I don't think at the moment, I think the, the, the national politics and what's going on in, in will have a pay, play a part. And of course, with local elections, it's how you get the vote out. Does the blue candidate stand at any oh, chance? No, you've got no chance at all. I thought I would ask, just in case. If, if, I, if I voted for the blue, my father would turn over his grave. I believe you me. Believe you me, you know. Ritchie is voting for an independent at the election. Yes, loyalties are shifting, but the instincts for many remain tribal. Simon Viger, Five News, Bridge End.